What's up, what's up, hello? Yeah! What are we doing? We are simplifying expressions with rational exponents. And here we go. We see that we have that rational exponent and we can convert it to the square root. Now, if there's nothing in the index, then it's assumed to be a two. So, sure, there's a two in the kink, and then the 16 in there, sure. So then you're looking at the square root of four times four. Now, you want pairs because that's a two right there. So I have a pair of fours, so one four comes out, and you're done. Box and flower. What's next? What if it has a fourth in the index? Oh God, oh God! That means there's a four in the kink, sure. So there's a four in there, and then there's an 81, but that 81 is nine and nine, and then, and then you have a litter of threes, a litter of threes, oh worries. So since this is a four, I'm looking for a set of fours. So then, what comes out? A three. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. What's next? This guy on over here, whoa. Yeah, sure. Then, that's the square root because that's a 2. That means there's a 2 in the index. And then there's a 25 over 81. Now, you can see that as the square root of 5 over 9 times 5 over 9. Because knock knock, who's there? How do you multiply fractions? Straight across. And we see we have a pair of 5 ninths. So, that's five nights. <laughs> Box and flower. What's up, what's up, hello? Trap queen. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time.